Welcome back to Dragon's Dogma 2. I'm a pawn today, so, you know, it's going to be fun. And I'm Kurigo, and we are going to, well, roleplay as a pawn, like I said. It's going to be a very weird mission, but this is the massive door that we have seen before while traveling through Bafal. Now we are going to learn much more about it. And I'm on my weak, because I have weak armor, I have weak uh, weapons, and we have a class that is underdeveloped. It's rank 1. It's going to be fun. Let us examine the area carefully. There may well be a clue nearby. Wait! You're not a pawn. We've an intruder in our midst. To arms! Oh, let me first equip something, please. There you go, equip. Oh, we still have the archer stuff with us. Not so smart, though, because we cannot carry anything. Look at how weak my gear is, though. I love it. <laughs> Ring of Ambition. Experience gain, always nice. And this one, yeah, yep. Mm -hmm. do, 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 do. Come on. Ay, 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 Don't attack me. I mean, Peggy is perfectly fine by being attacked. This is so weird. These attacks are so weird, man. I'm telling you. Oh, it is weird because it's like the magic archer, right? Uh, Alright, beautiful, I suppose. There we are. At least a little attack though. Yeah, we definitely have to upgrade the gear and stuff like that, right? You know, but it will happen in time. Because we barely do any damage right now. And I don't have the money. I just want to see how the elevation is going. Now we might be going back to our main class though, huh? It's going to be fun. Oh, wait a minute. No, we don't care about them. Oh, that was a failure. Thank you, ladies. Nice, nice, nice. So we have to let go of it too, huh? Easy mode, one might say. Look at that, we are just tickling everything here. It's so funny. You obtained some in, uh, uh, incriminating evidence. Is that so, huh? I wish I could loot them, though. I mean, that would be very nice. Ooh, Elizabeth. Beautiful name. Now, how do we enter this place? Oh, we cannot, huh? The Flame Bearer Palace uh, Spell Seal Door. Wait a minute. We are in Bakmafal? Oh, yeah, it is. I thought we were just on the outskirts of it, though. All right, big boy, let's talk here. I know I have. About the Phantom Box card. Element, your Majesty. Well, now, you have divined the Ox card's destination, then? Of course. I see. So they were procuring pawns in order to carry out this excavation. The stuff you mention is most curious. It sounds as if tis of the same make as the jewel wielded by the Queen Regent's puppet. I had heard pawns face much prejudice in Batal. Yet to hear that they are treated as tools to be discarded and given such perilous tasks, tis contemptible indeed. Volcanic Island has long been part of Batal's territory. The lake of lava present there is revered for its flames, which are sacred to the Batali people. Perhaps it would be considered blasphemy to give such work to their own. Or could this simply be a means of testing 
the efficacy of these jewels that allow for the control of pawns, I can offer no but conjecture. For now, we ought to aim our efforts towards proving that a member of the Vermundian court has been selling pawns. Should we succeed, even the Queen Regent herself could not deflect the people's displeasure. She would doubtless lose their confidence. You have my gratitude, Your Majesty. The evidence you have gathered shall form the stalwart pillar upon which our rightful claim will rest. Tis most valuable. So pray, exercise the utmost care when deciding how it ought be used. At least of course, of course. Shall face justice. You have and that's how we have completed fight. another mission. Now let's see, what do we want to do now? Hmm. hee hee ho well, I made a decision though, right? That we are not going to level up the mage. I might miss some Seeker Stones. I don't really care about it though in the end. I want to be right into the action, you know what I mean. I want to be face up to my enemy. Well met, sir. Arisen. Well met, Manella. Let us dispense with pleasantries and cut to the heart of the matter. I have a task that requires someone of your skill and discretion. Some days ago, a fiend attacked Empress Nadinya during her supplications. Her majesty was unharmed. But the would-be assassin fled, gifting me a wounded arm in the process. He may seek to strike again. Yet I fear I am not fit to guard the Empress as I am. And so I turn to you, Sir Arisen. Will you catch this villain in my stead? My deepest thanks. Her Majesty will next begin her supplications in Flamebearer Palace. I would use this opportunity to lure her assassin from the shadows. Empress Nadinia's life is in your hands, Sir Arisen. I trust you understand the gravity of this task. I do not. What does it mean? If you must go off on your own, there's naught to be done. I only hope you'll return sooner rather than later. And maybe sooner save. There we go. Save and continue. Ay, ay, ay. They are overwritten. Written a lot of times, right? So that is the queen. My oh my. This seems to be pure, how shall I say, necromantic, right, you know? Oh, wait a minute. I think I have to report here. Nah. Maybe we have to go upstairs. Who knows? Hmm, I don't think that's the Empress, so... Yeah, I, I don't know. Can we go away from this location or what is going on, right, you know? So just imagine right now, I just leave for a second and... There is the assassination, you know what I mean? Halt! Entry beyond this point is only permitted to researchers in the laboratory's employ. It is clear at a glance that you are not one of them. As you do not wear the provided uniform, I've got my eye on you. Do not dare to think that you could slink your way in. Do not dare! Oh, right over here is one. Alright, it's morning time right now. There's the Queen or Empress, so this is going to be interesting. Hmm. And who might? Irmhild? Interesting. One part of her name is actually German. Hild is something that, you know, you can hold on, like your sword has a hilt and everything. Sir Arisen, you've come just in time. Sir Irmhild, tis my pleasure to present to you the good Arisen. Come to aid us in apprehending the brigand who would threaten Her Majesty's life. Well met. Your assistance is most welcome. Without our Empress to guide us, Batal has no future. Her Majesty cannot be allowed to come to harm. Indeed. We are well glad of your aid. May it prove unnecessary. Ere Her Majesty's supplications begin, I shall give you a description of our target. Pray seize the rogue should you espy him. We would, however, prefer that this affair be kept quiet. Be not reckless in your decision, lest you apprehend the innocent. Empress Nadinia shall commence her prayers any moment now. I would ask that you safeguard her with your life. Should it come to that? 
Yeah, but what is the description, oh, though? Lambent flame, we offer thee these words of prayer on behalf of our people. What is the description? Bennett Bill of Arrest? What the? Right over here. Brigand who assailed Empress Nadinia. Okay. To be apprehended on sight. Descriptions raise his hair tied back. His right arm was wounded during the attack. Couldn't you just tell me that? Hmm. This is here back, but that doesn't say too much, right? This guy has an armband to the right. I'm sure I can handle this. This is where I when life gets. We ask that all be spared the horrors of the fell dragon. We ask that Batal may e'er prosper. And we ask that a day may come when Beastrum human pawn and every other noble race that walks our world may live in harmony with one another she didn't say if it was male or female right sir arisen her majesty's supplications are nearing their end have you located the rogue no but maybe now ay 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 I mean, it could be her, right? You know? I did not know that I had to actively seek for her. May thine hallowed fire burn aye, 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 aye. and cleanse our souls of all that is base. Here back. I mean, one of these guys had a sword, right? You know? Originate. And there we have the big boy. Yeah. Mm, I kind of want to talk to him, though. What's your problem? He's a very friendly he fellow, isn't he? Be spared the horrors of the Who are you but there we go. To be? Anyways. Fine. Are they on to me? Yes, they are. But the thing, though, is my boys and girls. I was way distracted. Oh, That's my problem. Apprehend there you go. Him at once. That man there is the assassin. He shouldn't have said Nicely a thing. Done, Sir Arisen. Let us inform Sir Ermhild of what has transpired. Somebody is going to be oh, tickled in the torture Majesty. chamber. Full glad am I to see you unharmed. The brigand has been captured. The chaos of the past few days ought to be behind us now. We owe this outcome to you, Sir Arisen. You cannot know the depth of my gratitude. Ah. Yes, of course. Batal is in your debt, Sir Arisen. The same is true of you, Sir Manella. Your efforts were most admirable, considering your wound. Is everybody a sir here? Now that a measure of peace is returned to us, however, you ought to devote yourself to convalescence for a time. You may. The curative hot springs on Volcanic Island are said to be wondrous for healing. Go there to recuperate. Very well, my lady. I shall leave presently and return when I am fully recovered. Grateful are we for your most valiant efforts, Sir Arisen. You're more than welcome, though. Ooh, five Jaspers. They are quite worth quite a bit. So this is Madame. Grateful are we for your most valiant efforts, Sir Arisen. I think that's the Emperor's, huh? Interesting. Let's have a little look around. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let's have a little look around first, right, you know, for some other things. A nice all heal. The thing that we are looking for is downstairs. But we are looking for some other things too in the meanwhile, you know. While we are here, why not take, uh, take care that we take everything that we can. Of course, this one. But there might be... Some intel lying around, right? Because we do know that these two kingdoms are corresponding with each other. Corresponding. 
Score corresponding to. All right, Sir Irmhild is a heartening ally for young emperors. I can only imagine how burdensome it must be to carry the weight of the people's fate, all while shouldering the uh, precepts of the lambent flame. Perchance, Sir Irm. Urmhild's devotion to her majesty is yet another form of the sacred fire's protection. Maybe, baby. Maybe the wallet over here is mine. Just placed here for curiosity. Hmm. So apparently we can just walk past the, the girt. Okay. Interesting. There seems to be girds over here though, but he don't stop us, which is interesting. Whoa, look at this though. Some Game of Thrones stuff going on here. The dragon seems to be alive though, doesn't it? Or in some type of stasis. Very, very curious. Hmm, lots of books. All right, all right. Why is Vermin funding our research? What do they have to gain from it? I don't know. Truth be told, I've never asked. But I heard a rumor that tis all part of a plot to put the prince, though I suppose he's the regent kin over there, on the throne. What? Where did he hear that rubbish? How's what we're doing here bear any relation to a scheme like that? Tis only what I heard, but you're quite right. It doesn't make much sense. I suppose tis a rumor best ignored after all. I do wonder what the director's plotting, but... <sighs> Frankly, as long as Batal is left out of it, I don't rightly care what he gets up to. Alright, good for you, boys. What was the missing that just arrived? Oh, you know. The usual. From Vermin, bound straight for the archives. Not to be opened. Another one? What is the director up to? Well, never mind that. Do we get any other deliveries today, perchance? Surely you're not expecting another one of your love letters. Why, just the other day, you were warned not to use this address for personal correspondences. You really mustn't be so imprudent. Need I remind you that if word of our activities here was to get out, we could be shut down. Yes, yes, I'm well aware of that, thank you. Now come, enough gossiping. We've work to be getting on with. Indeed, you two have to, though. Okay, let's just wait here for a second. Better not stand over here. A secret letter from Vermont. Eventually, this research became little more than a pretext for a bit of magic was reduced to a mere diversion. Enjoyed by a small group of elderly sorcerers. It was Lord Faesus, a, t a third tier of a f third tier? Tier? Okay, third tier er uh, age. And yet, with tries their brilliance, who restored the art to its former glory. It was also he who rescued me from the dull duty of archivist and renewed my hope for the future. From our very first meeting, I knew that if anyone could unravel the, uh, the truth of this world, it was he. Hmm. Let it to Lord Vassus. Alright, deliver the letter. Oh, wait a minute, we have that one. Interesting. Alright, alright, let's just check some other stuff in, in the meanwhile, right? You know? Hmm. For a bit of magic, as it came to be called, is a relative new form of sorcery. It was first introduced a little over four decades ago by a self-proclaimed missionary who declared it to be a means by which mortal kind could forestall calamity. Of course, in this nation, calamity is but a euphemism for the ruinous event of advent of the dragon, and this new branch of spellcraft, with its roots in dark magic, was touted as a power to control the beast. Ah, so in their despair they are doing these things, huh? Can't blame a person to trying to stay alive, I suppose. The beast was twofold the hate of any man. 
with tresses of writing snakes and the cruelty twisted visits of a woman. Every soldier who beheld her was turned to stone. The terror of their final moments etched upon their faces. Yet the news was fleet of food and knew no hesitation. A single thrust of his blade was all it took to sever the beast's head. So swiftly was it done that she knew not her own death. And her terrible gaze lingered on, petrifying the next to meet it. Sir, Th are you the Arisen? I? Then you must have been to the Argaman ruins. I heard a rumor that a Medusa was seen there. Yes. Is it true? Because if so, that means tis no mere creature of legend, but a monster as real as any other. Know you the legend of the hero Danaus? Yeah, the I know. One version of the tale claims the hero's foe was a Medusa. Yeah, the funny thing though is, right, you know, we could have gone and done this one before we would have done the statue mission and then we could turn the griffin into stone and then you know what I mean? Hmm? Bada bing, bada boom, a happy sculpture, a uh, happy nobleman. The legend is inscribed here. You must take it and read it for yourself, sir, seeing as you've witnessed the genuine article. I definitely will, though. But what else do we have here? Lord Faesos' genius knows no bounds. By avoiding all mention of forbidden magic in his research papers, he managed to earn the support of several high-ranking officials with the palace and thereby secure plentiful funding for his endeavors. In time, his war came to involve the rift traveled by pawns, being a in his of in this nation as harbingers of calamity, and ultimately converged upon the idea of summoning and controlling the dragon. Hmm. Can you imagine he just tries to destroy them? So that if there are no pawns, there is no arisen, right? I mean, that's logic for him, but, you know, there can still be a smith without a hammer, you know what I mean? At the time, the notion of control, uh, controlling the dragon was vehemently opposed by certain learned and individuals. So it was decided that this forbidden magic should be studied, unfortunately, away from prying eyes. Consequently, the art was first practiced beneath the palace, and research continued thereafter in total secrecy. Hmm. Anything we wear here? Yep. I have to explore everywhere, right, you know? I just have to. Where is this magical tunnel leading to? Hmm. Seems like we have been on the other side, but that doesn't mean much, right? Spidey spideys. Is this a prison? It is the damn prison, isn't it? It is. Laboratorium testing room. This is Batman. I myself will be sent to the pyre ere long. This surely only a matter of time. Yet I shall face my end without regrets and with my head held high. For there is no flame that can eradicate the truth or reduce my soul to ashes. And with my dying breath, I shall utter... These words, glory to Bafal and her unwritten history, death to Valeri the Unjust, self-seeking emperor and deceiver of the people. Oh my. Hmm. Silver crown. Ay, 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 ay. That's bad though, huh? Okay, I'm not sure what you are going to do with the blackened horn, but... Ah, uh, I mean, the name alone though, uh... Is a bad sign, isn't it now? I think we all have a creative mind. You know what I mean? What is this? Wow. Do you have dragon bones like this here too? It's a little bit troubling, isn't it? Wait a minute, why is it so fresh? <gasps> Have they been killing dragons here? Wait a minute. 
Do they want to have an army of pawns and combat dragons? Maybe, right? Oh, this is so exciting. It's a very interesting dormitory, sure. But what is it for? For who exactly, right? Hmm. This might be of their leader. Huh. I'm wondering truly what is going on, by the way, right now, you know, because I did hear something heavy. Workshop one, let's see. No, 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 this is all wrong. What use of pitiful fragments such as these? What we have achieved is sufficient to sway the pawns. But when the time comes to fell the dragon, I fear it may not be enough. Lord Phasus insists we shall succeed, and yet... There's the big boy, though. There's the big boy that we are looking for for the sword, but not alone the sword, right? There we go. What do we have in here? Farseer circlet. A new empress, Her Majesty Nadinia, was crowned, and yet the Forbidden Magic Research Laboratory has persisted. Its research into the Dragon Summons Continuum broken. The information we gleaned from our excavation of Moon Glint Tower proved vital uh, in our attempts to render the power to command the pounds in crystal form, eventually leading to our success. With this, the day on which Lord Fiasus will realize his ambition to conquer the dragon is surely nigh. I kind of respect his ambition though, but it is folly, isn't it? For many moons, our experiments proceeded apace. During that time, the fruits of my diligent study of ancient tomes allowed me to be of use to Lord Fiasus. What, uh, what's more, our contributions to the ob uh, what obviation of calamity saw the state grant us an official budget and furnish us with a research facility tailored to our aims. By the time this laboratory was erected, Lord Faes's standing has become second only to that of the Empress. Very dangerous, by the way. Ah, a new hand, are you? Have you some business with me? Yeah, I deliver you another kilo of ma mascara. Two pounds, that is. Why? Tis an arisen's. This... This is incredible. I've never seen such a luster. But why do you possess such a thing? Where did you obtain it? No. Never mind. Tis of no consequence. All that matters is this. With this alone, I shall be able to craft a superior godsway, the finest of all created to date. I must make haste that I might deliver it to Lord Phasus even a moment sooner. But wait, no. I have not the worm's life crystals to restore it. Concern it all! Mm. <laughs> oh, don't be ridiculous. Do you even understand what you are offering? Worm's life crystals can only be obtained from drakes. But I suppose I am in no position to decline, even if tis a fool's errand. Lord Phasus is satisfied with the God's way as tis, you see. And as I can expect no support from him, you can expect little aid from me. Though I suppose twouldn't do to send you away entirely empty-handed. Feel free to take what you require from the laboratory. Now, as I've said, Worm's Life Crystals can only be obtained from drakes and their ilk. Seek one out and fell it, if tis within your power. All the better if it happens to be a lesser dragon. You would be solving two of my problems, then. I mean... That's going to be fun and easy mode, right? Because don't we already... How many do we have to deliver? You've returned. Have you obtained any worms like Fifteen, my ball then sack, though. You good fortune. All right, fifteen. There is just a pop-up.
But yeah, by that though, I want to thank you all for tuning in. I really appreciate it. Have a wonderful time. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Stay happy, stay healthy. And don't forget to subscribe though. Bye-bye.